Hi, and welcome to my video review of the G600 headphones by Syllable. If you've read any of my review, or even just a subject line, you know that I love these. I, I really think they're absolutely fantastic buy. Here's why. Uh, first of all, this is the box they come in. It's a standard box. It's pretty, but nothing special about it. They just come in a, a plastic form insert. You don't get a bag with them, so no real reason to go into that. These are the star of the show. These are the Syllable G600s. Super nice headphones. As with a typical Bluetooth headset, you've got your power button and your controls for volume. This also answers calls or hangs up on them. Uh, this is the back of the headset, which is a good reason, a good thing, because this little light here will blink occasionally when it's connected. And if you wear glasses like I do, and you wear them the wrong way, you'll get that little light in your eye every couple of seconds. So you don't want that. You want to put them on the correct way, which is like this. They're actually very comfortable in my ears. Now my head is maybe a little bit wider than a lot of people's, and these are a little bit snug, but after having worn them for probably I don't know, close to eight hours now. It's uh, expanded out quite nicely. They feel very comfortable. The top has some padding on it. It's not super padded. If you're as follically challenged as I am, you know, maybe it's not quite as soft as you'd like, but actually I found them to be pretty comfortable. I was surprised how comfortable they are. Style-wise, I don't know if I'm exactly the target demographic for these, but I think they look pretty nice. Uh, comfortable, nice looking, easily adjustable. I like the way that they adjust. It sort of slides in like this. And, uh, you know, not too flashy, not too understated, just a nice headphone. When you listen to music on them, through Bluetooth, sounds pretty good. As far as other Bluetooth headphones go, unless you're looking at really high-end ones, I say these are as good as any other Bluetooth headphones I've listened to, even remotely in this price range. And I got them, and I thought, you know what, that's pretty good. I think they're, for $30, you can't go wrong. But wait, there's more. You can also plug them in. And when you plug them in... Not only did they not need to be charged at that point, oh, by the way, you also get a uh, USB cable to charge them. So it's actually a pretty nice flat ribbon cable. Charges nicely, plugs in the bottom here. But when you're plugging in the wired part, plugs in like a standard wired headphone, you put them on, plug them in, and start listening to music. And then that is when they really shine. The sound on these is absolutely phenomenal for a $30 headset. It's phenomenal for a $30 headset without Bluetooth, and for a headset without a microphone and the ability to make and take calls and without a built-in battery and a built-in amp. Just by itself, it's amazing. But the fact that they're able to get that good of a sound into something that's $30 with everything else that includes the Bluetooth capability, that includes the, the built-in uh, charging and, and, and the amp, and you hear my dogs in the background, sorry, is just, it, it, the sound is absolutely stellar. Are they as good as something really expensive like a high-end Sennheiser? No. Are they as good as the ATHs that are maybe $100 plus, $120, $150? No. But they're close to that. They're up in that level. They're at least at the level of probably $90, $100 headphones that you can buy that are dedicated headphones. And these are $30. They include Bluetooth, so you can wear them that way if you want. And they sound absolutely fantastic. Clarity is good. Bass is good, but not overstated and not too muddy. You get good trouble. It's not the most amazing mid-range I've ever heard, but it's actually pretty darn good. I listen to a lot of songs, a lot of older music I listed in my review that isn't meant for today's headphones where it's pretty much mixed just so it sounds good on cheap headphones. A lot of the older stuff is meant to be listened to on stereos or on good headphones, and it doesn't sound good on most of today's less expensive headphones. But that music did sound good on these. So for me, these are a very, very strong recommendation. They're 30 bucks. You just can't go wrong with that. I don't know what else you can even buy in this range, but I've had a number of uh, samples and, and listened to a lot of headphones that are about this much that are purely Bluetooth. They don't sound anything as good as these. They aren't nearly as comfortable. This cushion is very comfortable. The sound is absolutely fantastic. I can't say enough about them. They just, just buy them. They're really nice. Thank you.